Good evening, teacher. Hello, Gloria. How are you? Fine, teacher. And you? Good. Good. Excellent. Thanks. Waiting for you guys. Waiting for you. Ojalá que nos conectemos varios porque está lloviendo. Y falla el inter. ¿Y? Y falla el inter a veces. Yes. Well, uh, where do you live? Where, where do you live, Gloria? San Salvador. Ah, okay. Because uh, I live here in Lourdes and it was, it was raining very, very hard. But now it's, it's okay. In this moment, okay. it's okay. But uh, from six to seven, oof, it was raining. Really, really heavy rain. Okay. Hey, Good Alex. Evening, teacher. Hello, Alex. Hi. Where were you? Uh, I'm on, fine. On vacation. Uh, no, no. Uh, uh, descansando hoy. Yeah, that's good. To work tom uh, tomorrow. Okay, good. So you rest Monday in the week? Uh, los días son distintos. No ah, okay. nos descansamos. But it's one. Van only corriendo one. los días. Uh -huh. But only one? Yes, okay. two, two days. Ah, two days. Two days, okay, yes. Good. But no, not two days in a row? No, no. All right. Okay, let's see where are the others. Only two. I saw Angel. Angel disappeared. Okay. Sounds better here. Okay, we have the objective here is in this session, a conversation will be listened uh, to in order to practice the present perfect and simple past, okay? Always we have a little review, okay, about, hey, we didn't do this now, let's check. Okay, so we're gonna repeat this one quickly. Answer questions in present perfect with irregular and regular past participles. I want you to concentrate on this new tense. Notice how it is formed. Pay close attention to the words already and yet. Present perfect. Already, yet. The present perfect is formed with the verb have plus the past participle. Have you been to a jazz club? Yes, I've been to several. No, I haven't been to one. Has she ridden in a streetcar? Yes, she's ridden in one. No, she hasn't ridden in one. Has he called home lately? Yes, he's called twice this week. No, he hasn't called in months. Have they eaten dinner yet? Yes, they've already eaten. No, they haven't eaten yet. Contractions. I've equals I have. You've equals you have. He's equals he has. She's equals she has. It's equals it has. We've equals we have. They've equals they have. Haven't equals have not. Hasn't equals has not. 
For present perfect, we will use have or has plus past participle verb plus complement. The verb have or has will depend on the person we will talk about. We use present perfect when we want to express actions which began in the past and continue in the present. Example, she has worked in the bank for five years. We have had the same car for 10 years. When we want to make reference to an unfinished temporary period of time, I have worked hard this week. It has rained a lot this year. We haven't seen her today. Repeated actions in a specific period of time between the present and the past. They have seen that film six times. We have eaten all that restaurant many times. When timing is not relevant or it is unknown, someone has eaten my soup. Now let's talk about already and yet. Already usually goes after have or has and before the main verb. Examples, we have already had our breakfast. When are you going to do your homework? But I've already done it. Yet means that something that we expected has happened or hasn't happened. We usually put it at the end of a sentence. Examples, has the post arrived yet? Have you done your homework? Not yet. Haven't you got ready yet? Look at the time. Okay, good. Now we have the chance. See the now with check. Remember this one? Okay, complete this conversation. Choose the present perfect and use the verbs in brackets. Okay, which one is here? Have you sang much exercise? Have you, has you sang or have you done? Have sang. Have done. Okay, have you done much exercise this week? Okay, uh, Alex, number two. Uh, number two, have been. Have been. I have already been to aerobics class, okay. Good. What about number three? Uh, Gloria, number three. Perdón, te quedas apagado el micrófono. Okay. Eh, if I have, uh, I have you uh -huh. uh, play and sport this month. Have you played any sports this month? Yes, that's correct. Okay, Angel, four. Yes. No, I, I no. haven't. Mm -hmm. I haven't had. I haven't had. Okay. There you go. Good. Brenda? How many movies? Have been. Have? Huh? Have been. Have you been to? Been. Been. Yes, have you seen? Okay. Uh, Oscar? Six. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Number six, uh, Oscar. Number six. 
Number six, actuality. Uh, actually. Actually. I haven't uh, seen. I haven't seen any yet. Any yet. Mm -hmm. Okay, Daisy, number seven. Hi, teacher. Hello. Um, how, how, how do you, have you been to any interesting thing? Okay, have you been to any interesting parties? Parties recently. Okay, very good. Hey, let's see. Jose Hernandez, Jose, number eight. Number eight. Mm -hmm. I haven't, I haven't gone yes. to any party for quite a while. For quite a while. For quite a while, okay. Very good, excellent. Hugo, nine. Have, have you have you call any friends today? Have you call any friends today? Sandra? Have you call Sandra number ten? Yes. Mm -hmm. Number ten. Uh, yes. I Yes, I I already made three calls. Okay, very good. I've made. I've made. That's correct. Okay. Good, 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 good. Okay, all of them are correct. Okay, have, have you done? Uh, I have already been. Uh, have you played? Uh, haven't had. Have been. Uh, haven't seen. Haven't been. Haven't gone. Have you called? And I have made. Very good. So that's our score. Okay, this is the the review, the practica, okay, about the person perfect. Now we have a conversation we'll be listened to. Uh, practice the present perfect and simple facts. Hi everyone, a conversation will be listened to in order to practice present perfect and simple past at the same time. Notice how they use both tenses during this conversation. Listen and repeat. Listen and practice. I'm sorry I'm late. Have you been here long? No, only for a few minutes. Have you chosen a restaurant yet? I can't decide. Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? No, I haven't. Is it good? It's delicious. I've had it several times. Or how about Thai food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I lived in Thailand as a teenager. I ate it a lot there. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. <sighs> okay. This was the conversation. Now we go to the next stop. Just the present perfect versus simple past. 
Okay, and after that, we go to the practice. Hello to all. In this lesson, we will learn when to use present perfect versus simple past. What we are about to watch is question form in present perfect. Notice the way to answer. Present perfect versus simple past. Use the present perfect for an indefinite time in the past. Use the simple past for a specific event in the past. Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? Yes, I have. I ate it once in Paris. No, I haven't. I've never eaten it. Have you ever had green curry? Yes, I have. I tried it several years ago. No, I haven't. I've never had it. Okay. Hello to all in this lesson. Versus simple past. Use the present perfect for an indefinite time in the past. Use the simple past for a specific event. Okay, I will send you this to the um, peer group. And then we're going to practice. This is very small group. Okay, I guess this is good. Okay, I will send you these exercises for you to see in your in your telephone, in your cell phone. Okay, and then what you're going to do is that we're going to work in groups, well, in pairs and you are going to ask questions okay right uh, let's say uh, five questions or six questions with have you ever eaten have you ever had with different verbs okay for example suppose imaginemos que in one group is alex and sandra okay then uh, you write six sentences for example, have you ever gone to Mexico? Have you ever seen a, a, a scary movie? Have you ever eaten a, a snake? Have you ever eaten a snake? They say, yes, I have, no, I haven't. Okay, six questions with different verbs, right? Using have you, have you, have you ever? Okay, and you can answer, yes, I have. I ate it three years ago, or simply, no, I haven't, and that's it, okay? Is it clear what we're going to do? Yes? Preguntas? No, okay, very good. Then go to the groups, and we're gonna have, uh, let me see, about 12 minutes to practice in the groups. Okay, we're gonna have five rows. Join the group.
No, no. No, I... I have room. I have never room park extension. In park centenario. Uh -huh. Park centenario. Uh -huh. Esa es la respuesta. Va a ser have you uh -huh. room in the Yo le pregunto okay. have you Ahora ever... le voy a preguntar. Ok. Vale, le voy a preguntar. Have you ever driven a truck? Eh, no, no, no type in truck. No, I, I have never type in truck. No, I have never driven a truck. Driven a truck. I have never driven a truck. No, I have never driven a truck. Correct, okay, very good. Excellent. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, continue asking more questions. Pregunten todo lo que quieran, right? No problem. Okay. Ah. For example, have you ever eaten, have you ever eaten kusuko? <laughs> no, I think never kusuko. Uh -huh. No, I have never eaten kusuko. Kusuko. Okay. Yes, a snake tampoco. And a snake tampoco. That's delicious. <laughs> Okay. Good, good, good. Okay, continue practicando, okay? Okay, teacher. Todos los verbos que le vengan a la mente, no problem. Okay. Hola. Hola. Hola, estamos haciendo las oraciones. Perfect. Hola. Okay. ¿Quién está editando? Ya, le voy a pasar el control. Yes, I have. I drank piña colada yesterday. Yes, uh -huh. Okay. Ahí están combinando el present perfect with the simple past. Oh, no, I haven't. Okay. No, I haven't. Correct. Okay, now okay. another question. Okay, very good. Paris. Paris, come on. Y no hay heaven. No hay heaven. Ay. Tristemente. <laughs> Pronto será. <laughs> el próximo año. Yeah. Teacher, de las que hemos hecho, mm -hmm. le voy a mencionar algunas. Si quieren okay. mencionar una, una tú, Oscar, y una yo, para que. Ah, oh, ok. Eh, veamos. Have you ever swimming? Have you ever swum? Ah, okay. Eh, okay, swim. Have you ever swim? Mm -hmm. Okay. Eh, yes, I have. Otro ejemplo tuyo, Oscar. Mm -hmm. Para poder... Okay, have you ever... 
Have you ever eaten chicken? Have you ever eaten chicken? Yes. Have you ever eaten chicken? Yes, I have. Okay. Okay. Uh, continue, um, continue. Continue. Have you Gloria. ever, have you ever running? Have you ever? Running. Have you ever running? Have you ever run? Running. Have you ever run? Run. run. Uh -huh. Okay. Have you ever run? Um, yes, I have. Okay. Um, what else? Have you ever traveled the party? Have you ever? Travel. Travel the party. Travel the to, to Paris. To, to Paris. To Paris. Uh huh. To Paris, France. Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, and no, I have. No, I have it. Okay, good. Um. Solamente finish. Okay, good. Okay, okay. continue. Uh, for uh -huh. example, teacher, have you ever played the guitar? Mm -hmm. uh, no, I haven't. Yes. Okay. Have you ever played soccer? Mm -hmm. no, no, I, I haven't. haven't. No, I haven't. Or you can say, yes, I have. I played soccer last week. I don't know. Y ahí se combina con el pasado, right? Say, have you ever played yeah. soccer? Okay. And yes, I have. I played soccer last week. Okay. 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 Continue teacher, teacher, creating uh, more for, questions. Uh -huh. Teacher, uh, for the moment, uh, so for example, have you ever played soccer? Mm -hmm. Just played soccer last weekend. Last weekend. Uh -huh. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. I como play. Uh -huh. Lo que nos faltaba, digamos, como para hacer la oración más larga. Y combinarla con el pasado. Con el pasado. Eh, ya, ya ha jugado fútbol, le dice sí. Eh, de, hecho, de hecho, jugué la semana pasada. Ok, dice, uh, yes, I have. As a matter of fact, I played soccer last week. Okay, y ahí se hace como más, más, más este, específica, more specific. Okay, the information okay. that you give. Any other question? No, no, no. thank you. Okay, very good, excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Sad. Sad ever, ever eat, or ever the movie, the frozen movie. Porque hija no se dice igual que hijo, ¿verdad? Son es hijo. Daughter. Y hija. Daughter. Daughter sería. Daughter. Es daughter. My daughter. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Sí, my daughter is. Yes. Had you ever spoken the English, the language, English ever? English language. English language, okay. You Have you ever? Spoken the the English language. Have you ever spoken English? Uh, yes, I have. I speak. I spoke. The little. I spoke. Poco, ¿cómo se dice? Me, ah, okay. I speak a little. I speak you, a little. I speak a I, little. I, I speak a little. Okay. I speak a little. Um, have 
Have you ever uh, cook, cook, en, en pasado cook? Cooked. Cooked. Have you cooked, cooked, uh, robo? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. No, I haven't. <laughs> Never. Never. No, Garrobo, no. Can't believe that. Okay, good. No. Delicious. And snake? Snake? No. 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 Una vivora bien asada, right? No. <laughs> no. Okay, good. Not that one. All right. No. So then, have you ever have you ever cooked a what do you say, garrobo, right? Say no, I haven't. Okay, no. very good. Okay. I haven't. Okay. Continue with the okay. questions. Okay. Had you? Bing. B -E -E -N. E -E -N. Doble e -N. Eh, v. v. No, así está bien. No, no. B grande e, e N. Hay un bin visit. Yes. Have you been to Panama? Panama. To Panama. Uh -huh. Okay. In the second, in the second question, have you ridden? Ridden. Uh -huh. Like a horse, like a motorcycle. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yes, a reading. R I three. Mm -hmm. Yes. Double D. Two D. Double D. D D. Mm -hmm. Okay, correct. And the past tense of read reading is road. R O D E. E, e, e as in Ernesto. Okay, perfect. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Okay. A mountain le falta la U después de la O. Por eso que le aparece en rojito. You. Yes. There you go. Perfect. Ah. Uh... 
falta otra. No, ya están las cinco. Number three, uh, yes, I have a dream, a dream in the mountain size two months. Está bien. Yes, I have. Have you dreamt in the mountain? Yes, I have. I dreamt the mountain uh, two months ago. Two months with S and plural. Months. Okay, there you go. Mm -hmm. Now, have you seen, have you seen the movie? Yes, I have. I saw the movie yesterday. Have you been to Panama? Yes, I have. I was to Panama last weekend. Okay. No, I haven't. Okay, very good. Excellent. Thank you. Okay, excellent. How was the practice? Was it good? So so. So so. So so. So so. Okay, good. Difficult. So, so. Difficult. Easy. It's difficult. Practice, practice, practice for mm -hmm. the ace. The verbs, right? The verbs. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Remember. Okay. It says, "Have you?" Have you cried in from uh, many people? Okay, answer that question in the chat. Write your answers. Okay, write your answers, write your answers in the chat, please. What is cry, teacher? No remember. Ah, cry. Cry. When water pours out of your eyes. Oh, okay. Yes, cry. Have you ever cried in front of many people? Turn off your microphones so that we can not too much noise. Okay. Then, have you ever cried in front of many people? That is the question, okay? Pongan su respuesta en el chat, right? Write your answers in the chat. Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Yes, I have. I cried in front of... Uh, my friends this afternoon i don't know just yes i have no i haven't Okay. Let me tune the rest. No, the answer, the answer to my question, la, la, pregun la respuesta a mi pregunta, Oscar, right? 
Have you ever cried in front of many people? Mm. What happened? Oh, Tatiana is sharing. Yes, I have. Okay. Then you say, no, I haven't. I've ne I never, I have ne Angel, I have never. I have never cried in front of many people. Good. Hugo, have you not? The question. Yes, I have. Uh -huh. Yes, Oscar. Yes, I have. Gloria. Yes, I have. Brenda. Yes, I have. I cried. <laughs> Okay, I cry when, Brenda, I cry when I saw the movie with my family. I cry when I saw a movie with my family. And Hugo says, yes, I have. Okay, good. Now, let's see the, the next one. What was the question here? Uh, let me see. Uh, Oscar, have you ever eaten? No eating, okay? Remember, eaten, oh, okay. right? Eaten, okay. Uh, eaten, okay. Eaten, uh -huh. Sorry. it's okay, no problem. Have you ever eaten? What was your question? Have you ever eaten Chinese of the food? Okay, have you ever eaten Chinese food? Chinese food. Uh -huh. Yes, have I have. Yes, I have, okay. Now, another question could be, have you, have you ever seen, uh, let me see, have you ever seen, um, what can I tell you, what have you ever, Have you ever climbed a tree? Okay, look at the question. Have you ever climbed a tree? You can say yes. This is my answer. Yes, I have. I climbed an avocado tree when I was a child. Okay, to so say, have you ever climbed a tree? Have you ever climbed a tree? Yes, I have. I climbed an avocado tree when I was a child. Does Aki, you saw, yes, I have, present perfect. Y acá uso el simple past, look. I climb. Okay. Now, respondan esta pregunta, have you ever climbed a tree? Si es, yes, I have. Pueden ponerlo el, pas el pasado y si no, only no, I haven't. Negative, no, I haven't. Yes, I have. Oscar, let me say, yes, I have. Eh, La otra es, I climb a tree I last climb year. It. Okay, es, eh, sí, me faltó ahí. Me complete faltó sentence. La... Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, no complete. Okay, very good. Thank no you. No complete the question. Uh, the answer to the yes, I have a climb last year. I climb a tree last year. I climb a tree last year. Okay. Yes. Okay, good. Okay, Gloria, never climb a tree, so no, I haven't. Okay. 
Okay, it says, Hugo says, no, I haven't. All right. Angel, no, I haven't. Uh, okay, here, Alex, yes, I have. Okay, I have. Yes, I have. I climb a tree sometimes. Very good, yeah, Alex. Okay. Then Jose, yes, I have. Last year, then with the, the yes, I have punto. Last year, I climbed a tree in Bicentenario Park. Okay. Good. Tatiana, yes, I have. Okay. Period. Punto. I climbed a tree 15 years ago. Very good. Sandra says, yes, I have. Okay, very good. Okay, so you see, this is when we are combining the present perfect and the simple past. Okay. Alguien que escribe una pregunta y nosotros la contestamos. Write a question. Yes, Brenda, yes, I have. I, clam, I climbed uh, fruit trees of all fruits. Very good. Yes, me too. You know, when I was a child, I climbed uh, avocado trees, mango trees, uh, sapote, sapote trees. Uh, what was the other one that we used? Oh, nara, uh, orange, orange trees. Uh, the orange trees was very easy. The sapote, the mango, and the avocado trees were very high. It was difficult. Uh, let me see what else. Coconut, coconut tree never. I never did. Okay, write a question. Escriban una de las preguntas que estuvieron practicando, right? Have you ever played soccer? Okay, ya, vamos con esas dos. Have you ever played soccer? Yes. This is my answer. Yes, I have. Okay. Have you ever played soccer? Después vamos a contestar la U. First, Oscar. Have you ever played soccer? Yes, I have. Mm -hmm. Yes, Daisy. Yes, I have. Okay. Uh, Jose Angel. Yes, I have. Okay. Oh, Gloria asks, have you ever sung in karaoke? In karaoke, Gloria. Yes. Okay, yes, I have. But only in karaoke. Okay, good. Okay, all right, yes, I have. Okay, Hugo preguntaba, yes, I played soccer last week. Yes, I have, I played soccer last year. Very good, excellent, Tatiana, excellent, Alex. Hugo was asking a question, have you ever eaten fried fish? Yes, I have. Yes, I have. I love it. I love it, Google. Yes, I have. We are eating. Okay. Have you ever eaten fr uh, fried chicken? Yes, I have. What else? Yes, I have eaten. Okay, Oscar, eaten, eaten, no eating, remember? Oh, okay. Okay. Eaten, eaten. Eaten, eaten, eaten. eaten. Yeah. Similar, eaten. the pronunciation is similar. Okay. Yeah. Eaten, eaten. Yes. Eaten. Yeah. Sorry, sorry. No problem, no problem. Miss practice, don't worry, Oscar. Miss practice, good. yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, Alex, yes, I have. I have, uh, I ate. Oscar, I ate. Yesterday, oh my goodness, in the beach, eight, okay, past tense of eight. Yes, I have, they see, I have eaten fish. Good. 
And then I have yes, I have. Okay, good. So you see how how much uh, English and verbs you can produce, right? Using the. Mm -hmm. Yes, Daisy. Okay, you can produce by using different verbs. Now let's see, let me show you what we have for tomorrow. Okay, si ven, esto es lo que estuvieron practicando, look. Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? Yes, I have. Y luego vamos al pasado. I ate it once in Paris. Okay. Have you ever played soccer? Yes, I have. I played soccer in uh, last uh, year. I played soccer yesterday. Entonces, use present perfect for a definite time and use simple past for a specific event. Okay. Ahora, le explico que eh, when we say have you ever eaten is um, let's say it's very general but when we use the simple past it's more specific okay for example when we say uh, I have you ever eaten Moroccan food yes I have ha comido Comida de Marruecos, sí, okay. But when you say, I ate it once in Paris, la comí una vez en Paris, then that's more specific. That's what I say, use the simple past for a specific event in the past. Teacher. Yes. Uh, yes. Request answer short. What's your answer? Yes, I have. Negative? No, I haven't. Okay. And this is more specific and long answer. Okay. Okay. Good. Then, excellent. Okay. So for tomorrow we have. Well, the knowledge check, tomorrow we're gonna have this knowledge check. More practice with the present perfect. And wait, um, and then we have for and since. Okay, for and since, for y desde, okay? So these are the different ones. Okay, everybody, any questions? Today? Not issue. No questions. Okay. No. Then, no. study. Eh, ¿Han tenido algún contratiempo? Vamos a hacer un poquito una, dos minutos. O, ¿no? ¿Algunos contratiempos con la plataforma? ¿Algo que, que se salga un poco el académico? No. 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 Okay. Ah, todo bien. Vale. Si tiene alguna duda también, por que se acuerdan aquellas comas a veces o algunos detallitos que les aparecen. Si tiene alguna duda, pues me avisan para poderles echar la mano porque ya solo dos clases más y ya el viernes ya tienen que ustedes terminar y presentar el examen para que ya les salga su diploma ¿okay? entonces este, cualquier pregunta pues me la hacen a llegar ahí por el whatsapp ok ok, okay very good have a good night see you tomorrow ok teacher see you tomorrow good night bye